Hi guys, welcome back. This is Tarun again back with another fitness video. So guys, in this channel, you know, I share my fitness experiences with you. You know, obviously backed by science. It's not bro science. You know, if you're thinking it's bro science, backed by research, backed by, you know, uh, various other experiences I've had with many bodybuilders, fitness trainers, and you know, pretty much everyone and everyone around the fitness industry so that you could get some benefit and use that in your training and diet. So here's another interesting video for you folks. Now, you know, if you are watching this video, I'm pretty sure you're following other YouTubers as well. When I say other YouTubers, I'm also, I also mean some bodybuilders too. And, and one of the famous bodybuilders, IFBB bodybuilders that you must have seen is Kai Green. Now, Kai Green, you know, if you see, usually wears a hoodie and, uh, uh, you know, you would never find him training without the hoodie. So what I've also seen is that a lot of people, the newbies in the gym, you know, they also wear a hoodie because Kai Green wears it, you know, not, it's nothing to do with fashion, huh? believe me. It's mostly to do with the, a fact that people feel and you know, this was my myth too while growing up that I would see some trainers, I would see some athletes wearing sweatshirts and, and you know, jackets, you know, in summers. Yeah, there's a catch point. Summers, uh, wearing those jackets uh, uh, and, and uh, training. And I would think that, you know, hey, maybe, maybe wearing these jackets in a hot, sunny weather can have an effect on your, you know, on your training goals or on your fat loss goals or, or any goal whatsoever. You must have seen these guys, you know, because I've been getting these questions a lot of late from people that, you know, Tarun, wearing a jacket in summers or wearing a sweatshirt in summer or while running, do you think it will accelerate our fat loss effort? So here's my answer to you guys. In this video, I'll be addressing that issue. It won't. So if you're thinking by wearing a sweatshirt or by wearing anything in a hot sunny weather, you feel that if you were to sweat more, you'll burn more fat, guys, you're highly mistaken. You know, if sweating made you, and, and sweating is not the right barometer to gauge that, you know, you're burning fat, guys. And just because, you know, there are a lot of people in the gym, there are a lot of people who I've seen train, they don't sweat at all, but they are in top shape. Imagine, just imagine, you must have seen a steam room, right? You know, where, you know, guys and girls, they, not together though, and they, you know, people take steam, steam baths, so to say, and in about five to seven minutes, you start sweating. Do you lose weight? If, if, if sweating has any component or, or any impact on weight loss, people coming out of the steam room, you know, because they're sweating so much, will be about, what, three kgs, four kgs lighter. It doesn't happen like that guys so what happens is when you sweat more while training while wearing a jacket or in your steam bath for that matter what you're typically losing is about water weight now water weight is nothing it's about 200 300 odd grams now imagine when you train in you know let's say it, because most of the gyms these days are air conditioned but if you're training outdoors and in outdoors you know if you're wearing those jackets in a, in a weather somewhere in india it gets about 40 45 degrees celsius in most of the most of the cities guys it's not a good thing what you're doing is you know obviously when you train you're you're elevating your heart rate level wherein you should be wearing lesser clothes but you on the contrary are wearing more so you're suffocating yourself why are you doing that you're not kai green you know you're not one of those you know advanced elite trainers you know who pretty much don't want to show off their bodies because you know i've read a lot of kai green interviews i've seen a lot of other trainers why they wear these hoodies and why they cover themselves up is because in india what they say nazar you know the evil eye they only want to show their body in a contest prep or probably when they have a photo shoot that's the only reason they cover themselves up so that they show the world but if your goal is to train if your goal is to train comfortably in a sunny so hot weather why would you want to wear a jacket or a sweatshirt you know you can do that in winters you know obviously you have to do that in winters also once you start sweating you can choose to take it off because the idea for you is to maintain that thermogenesis wherein you know you have to give your body that breathing space guys don't try to emulate any of these guys huh? because you know just because they wear it you know you can choose to wear it as a fashion statement but don't expect any result out of it now coming back to you folks now if you're hitting the gym now you may want to wear it for about first 10 to 15 minutes even in sunny weather whatever it is warm yourself up and then just take it off you know if if that's what you want to do but guys do not train in it it's not good it's 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 not going to be good for your 
health you know some people if you're elite trainer or if you are an elite athlete you know who pretty much have understood your body you know who know what you want to do with your body you want to understand you you pretty much know how you know attack your body with different training programs and diet then it's different then you can manipulate it but guys if you're a newbie or if you you know few months old in the game and then trying to emulate those guys by wearing sweatshirts guys don't do that it's it's not worth the on the contrary it may get a little riskier guys just imagine you may also invite dehydration i'll tell you it has happened with me so i thought because i was a fat kid i thought you know what maybe you, and plus you know when you're fat you really don't want to show off your body you really want to cover it up so even in hot sunny weather i used to be wearing you know track suits and stuff and what happened i used i would run in a in a weather like that about 40 45 degrees uh, because i was sweating more so i had this illusion that you know what i'm because i'm sweating i'm burning more fat which i wasn't so what happened in about 15 minutes i got dehydrated now dehydration means that obviously you know i went through this whole hypoglycemic mode wherein that you know i was craving for water you know obviously i needed some salt you know my salt from my body just got deprived of it it just you know got released you know because of this whole sunny weather i paid the price i i was i could have been in a very different situation guys so the moment people saw me dehydrated the moment you know uh, uh, an elderly person saw me that you know because i was sweating profusely uh, because of the sunny weather the first thing that person it was take off my jacket and guys immediately i started feeling a little better so guys it's not a good thing for you to wear a jacket you know if you really want to train train you know in comfortable clothes you know and just to kind of bust that myth to you it will not have any effect on your fat loss goal so i hope this thing gets into your head loud and clear you train comfortably comfortably in, in any kind of clothes you want to wear but yes you may want to try to cover it up if you don't want to show it but you know what you can also wear a loose t-shirt you know so that you know you give your body that breathing space so any one of you who have any questions around this feel free to reach out to me either on my instagram facebook or youtube but i'll be very happy to help you with your uh, uh, sweatshirt goals if you should you wear it or should you not wear it until we meet again peace